Welcome to My Story Maker, presented by Candace Sizemore, current kindergarten teacher at Baitable Elementary. How many know children who absolutely love to write? Not many do. But how many know children who love to tell you stories? Most of us do. What if we could encourage children to express their ideas by creating a story online? My Story Maker allows children to do just that. Students are given the power to design the pages of their book down to the pictures, colors, and text. Educators, among various grade levels, can take numerous content areas and have students show their knowledge by creating a story. For example, students can write a story about solving a math problem or give step-by-step -step directions about moving from one location to another. Everyone will love how user-friendly My Story Maker is. Students can select their character, change the setting, add objects to the scenery, and type the entire story page by page. Students can share their final products with others or be limited to a class participation where they share only with members of their class, all by looking at what appears to be a real book. My Story Maker is a free web application available online with numerous possibilities all at your fingertips. Enjoy the numerous uses of My Story Maker. Throughout this instructional product, we have four goals. One being that the adult user can navigate the web application My Story Maker. A second, that they can identify the uses and features of My Story Maker. A third, that you will actually be able to create a story. And lastly, that you can participate in an engaging web application. We have three objectives set forth. One, given several choices, the user can identify the features of My Story Maker with 80% accuracy. A second, given a task, the adult user can create a story using My Story Maker with success based on the success criteria found within the instructional product. And third, given the opportunity to self-assess, the adult user can demonstrate a positive outlook of the application for their very own personal classroom. Before beginning with My Story Maker, there are some prerequisite knowledge skills that would be important to have. One, basic internet skills, typing skills, grammar skills, a splash of creativity, knowledge of sequential order for this particular example, understanding parts of a story, and WordPress. WordPress is important so that feedback can be gained for the instructional product. On the screen you will see a pre-assessment. Please pause and take a few moments to assess how you currently feel about teaching a content by creating a digital story. After posting your feedback to the WordPress, you may continue. Let's begin. For step one, you'll need to open your internet browser and Google My Story Maker. This is the quickest way to access this web application. You'll want to click on the first pop-up, which is the Carnegie Library of Pittsburgh. Upon clicking on the link, you'll be taken to My Story Maker. You'll want to click on the box on the right corner of your screen that says My Story Maker. You will then be directed to a welcome screen. You'll want to click on the book to begin. You'll immediately begin setting up the pages of your story by typing in the author, set, setting a goal, a main character, and a setting. My Story Maker will then ask for your approval and then you will begin diving into the pages of your book. You can either create your story with some instructions or dive right in and start. In this sample, you'll see that we dove right in and started creating our story. On this page, you will see the design page where you begin setting the page of your book. You'll choose the character, the items that you want displayed on the page, the scenery objects, as well as the setting. Below the pages is where you type the text of your story. 
As we continue, you can see how numerous options appear, such as being able to change how the character moves and shows emotion. You can see that we can move the character around, and every page can appear differently. After writing your story, you can preview or you can share. On the screen, you will see an example of the preview button. My Story Maker is a web application that shares creations on site. Your story will be stored on their website, which means it can be public. However, schools can create an account which will limit their children so that their creations are private and not viewable to the public. Upon returning to the My Story Maker Online website that you were originally directed to, you will see a box underneath My Story Maker where you type in the magic number to see your story created online. If you go to the sample page, the magic number is 634215, you will see a sample creation directly related to social studies content. Your creation is stored on site for one month and it loads as an Adobe document. Now it's your turn. You're going to take a few moments to create a short story to tell when election day is this year, who the candidates are, and what office they're running for. Take a few moments to try to get your character to move, to change the scenery, to type out the brief story. Create your story by either viewing it as a preview or sharing it online so that you can see what it looks like. Upon completion, please provide feedback in WordPress and then continue on. Before we continue, let's take a few moments to pause and reflect on what we have learned about My Story Maker. The following questions are to assess what you have learned about the web application. Please take a few moments to complete and provide your feedback in WordPress. Lastly, after your reflections in WordPress and discussions and the efforts that you have made in creating your own story, please complete the following feedback. I'm sorry, complete the following assessment. We are asking you to create a story showing and explaining the steps to get to a chosen location. Later on in the production you will see how this directly relates to our core content. While you create your story, use the checklist to self-assess. See if your story is illustrated, if it explains directions, and how comfortable were you with, create, with using My Story Maker. Lastly, you'll see a short, simple rubric. Use this as another self-assessment tool. Was your story that you created illustrated? Was it at least six pages long? And was the story in sequential order? Again, please provide feedback to WordPress. On the remaining slides, you will see how My Story Maker can directly relate to AASL standards and core content standards. You can see that My Story Maker shows a demonstrated mastery of technology tools. It incorporates the writing process and technology and it uses a creative and artistic format that allows users to express personal learning. Core content is addressed in this particular example by showing that geographic tools can be used to locate places and identify geographic features. While many things are cross-curricular, My Story Maker also relates to reading standards and that events, procedures, and ideas in a historical, scientific, or technical text can show what has happened. Hopefully you've enjoyed My Story Maker and find it successful and can walk away from this instructional product filled with numerous ideas of how to incorporate this into your classroom. Thanks.